Hi guys, welcome back to the vlog. Here we are again in the daily, in the, sorry, in the prior wagon. We're off to up our hill. It's a lovely evening here in Shropshire. Hopefully, it's gonna be nice at the hill. Hopefully it doesn't rain or anything. But I ha highly doubt it will. Anyway, see you later. Danger. Are you gonna do something dangerous? Oh, hoo, hoo. Yeah. You gonna have a go, Tom? I think there's definitely a skill to um, not right. zooming in too far on people's faces, right. just Serves far enough. Stop right. it. Okay, this is Dan out. Can't turn my hand away. See you guys. Bye. Hi guys, this is Isaac <laughs> signing on for today. <laughs> uh, <laughs> oh, there are people in front of us. Oh, can I tell you guys a story? Go on then, Dan. Where's Dan? So, uh, I don't know if any of you guys know, but we're here in Pontsbury. Some people call this place Pontsbury Hill. Some people call it Earl's Hill. We call it Earl's Hill. But the Scott family, we call it our hill. Because we bought it. <laughs> it's all looking yeah. very yeah. family estate. <laughs> Man, I'm not sure. All very walkable. Oh, uh, which way do I go? I'll go. Oh, okay. Um, but yeah, it's. I'm enjoy enjoying a lovely walk here, trying to avoid the nettles with my legs. <laughs> I don't know if you got my legs in that shot. No, but I saw you jumping. But I jumped quite high. So, uh, Isaac just gave me the camera and said, sign on, Jonah. So here I am, signing on. Hi, signing on. Um, Hi, Dan. Hi, signing on. <laughs> okay. Yes, um, Tom. Just doing a little film. So here we are guys. We've just come over that ridge. Um, not a great view of it from here because we've just come down. It was quite windy so we couldn't do a lot of filming. Um, old Iron Age Fort used to be up there back in the day when uh, Iron Age Forts were a thing. Um, yeah, I think this side is actually Earls Hill and the other side is Pontsford Hill, or as uh, my posh friends say, Pontusford Hill. Uh, I've only got one of those, only one posh friend. He's not really a friend. Who is it? Shut up. Um, so we're about to head down now, go back round the hill. It's a very lovely route. Um, there's some good places to scramble, as in climb. And what, what do we need to do? Do we need to use... Love Jesus. <laughs> okay, do we need to end up dead? Or... Oh, get out alive? Yeah. Okay, sweet. <laughs> oh. Now this, this is wild mint. It's really good for keeping your, your breath fresh and for your uh, metabolism. It keeps you really healthy when you need to burn fat fast. So I'll take a bit of this now. <clears throat> Minty. I'll take some of this. For later.
Hi guys. In the jungle, or anywhere, it's always really important to concentrate on personal hygiene. Now, with this tree, it's a bit of ash, I think. I know. <laughs> it's really, these are really good for just brushing your teeth. So you just get them, make a little toothbrush like that, and just... Get all in there, and make sure you do that for two minutes. I've already done it. Uh, not then, but previously, so I don't need to anymore. Let's go. <laughs> so guys, in the jungle it's so important to stay together as a team. Tom has just twisted his ankle. Classic Tom. Hey! <laughs> <laughs> and, and now I have to to carry him. This is important because if I just left Tom, he'd be probably just a a rib cage by now. It's always really important to have your van ready for when you come back from your walk. After you've had your mint, which is good for fresh breath, and, and you've brushed your teeth with your ash leaves, and you've ran at, ran away from the things, and you've stuck together like a team when Tom Flippin hurts himself. <laughs> <laughs> um, it's always really important to uh, not get angry at the slow people in your in your group as well, because uh, <laughs> when you shout at them and they're out of breath, things just can escalate quite quickly. Um, also, get a good pair of shoes. People often say um, walking boots are the best for walking. Well, they are quite good, but they give your ankle they give your ankle lots of support. Now, if your ankle has they if your ankle has lots of support, it can often weaken the ankle because you have that much support. Your ankle thinks I don't need this. I don't I don't need to work for myself anymore. Um, <coughs> which is why. Trainers are good because if you get them wet, they dry out quickly and they give you the right amount of support. Are you talking about bras? Can <laughs> 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 we bleep out when Mum says the B word? <laughs> <laughs> I don't really want to sit in the front anymore. <laughs> do you love it? Get off. <laughs> Mum said the B word, Dad. The what? The B word. The B word? Bruh. What? <laughs> oh. Don't want that kind of talking, Dad. It's, ch it's children play. Don't want that kind of language in no. the prayer wagon. <laughs> no, why? Why? Oh, yeah, why is that? Mm -hmm. Plenty it's about it's not prayerful. prayerful at all. There's plenty about breasts in the Bible. I know, but not about bras, is there, Claire? 